Hello, I'm Lee Lin Chin, Australia's best Asian and the SBS Cultural Competence Officer. Over the years, SBS has celebrated cultural diversity and we've welcomed token employees of many racial backgrounds, be they Greek, Hi. Bangladeshi, Sri Lankan, same thing, Muslim. Love that hat. Hijab. Oh, it's cute. Have to have one. If you want your company to stay competitive, you must train everyone in your team in cultural competence, diversity and inclusion. And not just the white people, whom we all know are the main offenders. So let's meet the SVS team. Mikey, you look normal enough. What exactly are you? Well, Elin, my parents were Romanian-born of Greek extraction. So got a little bit of the gypsy in you, eh? No, Lily, not at all. What about this Greek thing? Does that mean you're always stealing fruit from other people's gardens? Lily, Lily, you really should think about taking this course. It's been suggested to me, but I don't know why. Now to the situation in Syria, where there's been... I'm just doing I, the news I, where there's... I won't take a minute. I'm just checking that cultural competence is being observed. It's it's all good, Leland. That the... Italian camera guy over there, is he posing a problem? What are you talking about? Well, he can barely drive a car, let alone handle a camera. <gasps> Perhaps the most interesting thing about Lucy Zelic is her family comes from Croatia. Well, I wouldn't say it's the most interesting thing. I would. Is this about the time I parked in your spot? Tell me, Lucy, what does cultural competence mean to you? Well, it's about building cross-cultural communication. We may be different, but there's always common ground. Aha, uh -huh, but that common ground isn't Li Lin Chin's parking space, is it, Zelic? Can we cut? <laughs> My dear Antoninus, may I begin by acknowledging your elders as the traditional owners of this land. What are you talking about, Lee Lin? I come from South Africa. I could have sworn. You are taking the cultural competence course, aren't you, Lee Lin? They keep suggesting that to me. I have no idea why. Andy True. Hey. What annoys you most about other races? Well, the whole point of the program is to promote understanding and harmony between two cultures. Do, we, do you know what unconscious bias is? Is this when Chinese people always fall asleep on trains? No, um, it's, it's when your brain unconsciously favours people that look like you and it kind of reminds you of yourself. Oh, that's why I respond so strongly to Angelina Jolie. You have done that cultural competence course, haven't you? Let's do the course, Leland. OK, OK. The Cultural Competence Programme features a multimedia online training module. There are many other resources that help build employee capabilities in these often sensitive areas. It's also easy enough for a Gold Logie nominee to use. So what are you waiting for? 